It is November the 20th, 2020. This is the Menorcan Mullets daily check-in on the visit out to the Golden Ray Rec site. We have today been out, I made a little earlier trip today, and we saw not a whole lot. We could tell by the angle of the, the, the cutting blocks that they have cut. You can see that they're a little bit even more uh, angled than they were yesterday. And the left side or west side, if you will, block has a little more uh, angle on it as well. So we know that it is making a little bit of headway through the hull material. Now, we've had some comments that perhaps uh, you know it's, this is slowed down because the, this particular uh, construction in the bow uh, might be a little stronger, might be thicker material that's in there. That very well may be the case. And as we, uh, I suggested maybe yesterday, this may be, they may be actually slowing it, uh, waiting for better weather for opportunity to go ahead and finish cutting to be able to lift it and get it on the barge, the Julie B. That's going to be a little bit of a, a maneuvering uh, feat to get the, the huge barge through the south gate and underneath the lifted section of the Golden Ray and then lower it back on the barge. So we're anticipating that happening uh, after, uh, soon after the, the bow is cut. But for right now, we're, we're kind of in a slow mode, but still cutting. Now, it was a beautiful day on the St. Simon Sound. Just beautiful blue skies. A little windy. We had a little, little sea again. It was a, a little bit of swell that was bouncing uh, the boat, but uh, we know that this weather, uh, as, as these fronts come through, we're gonna see we're going to see changes like this, uh, and the, rock, the wind was blowing pretty strong out of the northeast today. Um, probably 10 knots steady, gusting to 18 at, uh, at the time we were out on the uh, water. Now, while we were out there, we did see uh, the fleet of environmental boats uh, working down current, if you will. Uh, tide was coming in when we shot these uh, videos, and they were down working on standby looking for anything that might be uh, on the surface of the water and ready to deploy their, their skimming equipment to, to remove that. Now our vessel highlight today, this boat might not be the most visible or important vessel on the water but we can assure you it is pretty high on the priority list. This is the uh, vessel that the environmental boats, the guys that are staffing those boats, utilize uh, for their uh, comfort needs, if you will. Um, and yeah, this is this this we're glad to see this thing out. Uh, and uh, I'm sure that the environmental folks that are out there as well really, really appreciate seeing this vessel. As you can imagine, when the seas get rough and this tiny ship is tossed, you know, it can make your, it's just not a job, it's an adventure. But this vessel, yes, does play an important role in the whole scheme of the of the salvage operation. And uh, we're certainly glad to see it on station, ready to uh, 
help the, uh, the guys that are out on the water. Hey, if you haven't done it yet, please subscribe to the channel. There should be an icon down low. Uh, if you can't find that icon, back back out to the, to the page and, and hit the subscribe button. We're really trying to get to a thousand mark so that we can go live when this bow is picked up and put on the barge, and we'd love to be able to do that for you guys. All right, you guys stay safe, and we'll try to talk to you tomorrow.